Emily here aka Phoenix Opinion. I'm back with another vinyl unboxing for you. It's one that I've been looking forward to getting. I've ordered it from a company called Black Screen Records so I believe they are based in Germany and I really like their funky packaging so I thought I would show you that on here. So what I'll do is I'll get inside the box now and I'll show you what the vinyl is. Pop the packaging down here. I like that you also get a little black screen records postcard and also a sticker which you can put on your vinyl player or wherever else you want to stick it. And yeah, the vinyl that I've got is the Stray vinyl soundtrack. Now, I don't know about you, but I loved Stray the game. I do love cats. I'm a big animal person as it is, but I loved this game. It came out in July 2022, so last year. I actually played it Christmas time when I was really poorly at Christmas with COVID. So I was all snuggled up playing this and I just had the best time with it. Played it in low lighting with the Christmas tree lights on and yeah, it was just a lovely time to play it really when I was feeling poorly. You could play it on PC and on your PlayStation. It is soon coming to Xbox. On the front here, we've got, obviously it says Stray, but it's all in the language from the game. And we've got a lovely foil print of the Stray cat on here. On the sticker here it says it is a two times 180 gram audio file black vinyl so it's just a black colour. Futuristic premium packaging. Gatefold jacket housed in an elegant slipcase. Music by Van de Croyson. I believe that's how you pronounce it. And the album art is by Fernando Correa. I've got to get it out of the sealed packaging just so you can see it properly because it's very reflective with the lights around here. And there we go, that is the front cover. Look how great that looks, that is amazing. I love the hollow foil just on there. And it's a really nice matte finish. Picture of Stray there on the front. And then we've got a little Stray just on here. It also says Stray just here. Let's get the gateful packaging out and see what that looks like. So yeah, on the front here, we've got some imagery. Now, I don't remember all of the robots' names, but if you remember their names, then please do comment them. But there are two of the Android robots here that live in the walled city. We've got Stray here, just in the background. And then we've got B12, just here, floating above Stray. I can't quite remember who these two robots, their names are. If you do remember, then do let me know. And then on the other side, We've got some of the Ward City, so we've got like a vending machine here. I love the pencil style artwork. I'm just going to fold that out so you can see that there. It's originally from IM8 Bit, so it is an IM8 Bit record. And then inside, we have got another robot playing a vinyl player, funnily enough. And they've got a stray sticker just here, and it looks like a Zerk sticker as well. And yeah, some other stickers just over here, but yeah, it's like a lovely artwork. Really, really love that. Let's get the first file out. Oh wow, look at that lovely image of Stray, the cat just on the front there, I love that. That is so cute. And then on the back here, we've got Zerks, so the evil little creatures. These are the main sort of enemies that you'll encounter in the game. Where you've got the walled city, which is based on Kowloon in China. So it's based on the walled city of Kowloon. And I thought that was really interesting. And it was built that way to shield humanity from a catastrophe, I believe that's what the story of the, the walled city is. Humanity are doomed because humans don't exist anymore in the game. That is because of a virus, which is something to do with the Zerks. So if I remember rightly, and you've got B12, who was one of the last humans that tried to download his consciousness into a robot, but it kind of failed. So B12 kind of was stuck in his little body. You know, Stray comes to save the day really. And that's where the story takes takes place after they meet. Yeah, let's get the first final out and show you what it looks like. I'm just going to make sure that you can see it. And it's be a bit difficult to get out like this. So yeah, I don't want to touch it too much. That is lovely. So on side eight, you've got a sentinel just on the front there. And they're one of the main enemies of the game alongside the Zerks. These will shoot at poor little stray cat and kill you if you're unlucky enough and it's really sad I hate getting killed in Stray it's horrible. On side A it's got the names of the tracks I'll just read those out to you. Inside the Wall, Follow the Light, Intruder, Guardian and The Notebooks. And then we've got side B just there and we've got a robot's head on there and side B has got Rooftops, Town Square, Communication, Secret Lab and Raft. Yeah that is side A and B I'm just going to put them back into the slipcase. 
and we'll oh there's something in there oh there's something else in here i'm just going to see what that is ah redeem this code on steam for a digital copy of the soundtrack oh wow so yeah that's pretty cool so that's an extra little added bonus but i didn't realize that was in there so i nearly damaged the cover Pop back in. okay let's get this other side out and what have we got in here oh we've got b12 on here so b12 just here I love that artwork actually. And then we've got another robot just on this side. And if you know the names of that robot, I'm not quite sure, but if you know, then please do put it down in the comments. It's such a beautiful vinyl. And then, so side C, we've got some computer monitors on there with little faces. That's quite cute. On here, it's got Sewers, Ant Village, and Outlaws. So there's only three tracks on that side. So they'll be pretty hefty tracks, I would say. And then on side D, so we've got a nice little picture of a palm tree just on there. Side D has Trash Zone, Riconium, Stealth, Clean City and Daybreak. That should probably be the end of the games. If you've played Stray, I'm not going to spoil the story, but you'll know the ending. It's very heartfelt, lovely little ending. Quite sad, bittersweet, but quite a beautiful ending. I would highly recommend this game, so I'm just going to pop this back in its case. So as always, what I'll do is I'm going to include some of the tracks that are my standout favourites in this video. And then within a few days after this video has gone up, the full track list will be uploaded to my channel. I would highly recommend listening to that if you want to hear the whole of the final and if you love the soundtrack as much as me. The soundtrack has a very synth vibe, so it's a synthy soundscape and it's got like a whimsical charm to it, obviously, because it's about a cat the main feature of this game. Yeah, it's a very chill soundtrack. It's, it's lovely. If you've not heard the straight soundtrack, I highly recommend you listen to it once I upload it or just play the game because the game is amazing. It's a lovely little indie title. It was so different from anything that I've ever played and it was kind of that kind of game that I just needed to unwind. So it was a nice end of the year game for me that I played. Um, but I would highly recommend it. So yeah, as I said, I'm going to upload some of the standout tracks and then I will put the full vinyl track list up on my channel within a few days after this video. So do look out for that. I'm just going to play you some of my favourite tracks from the vinyl now. So check those out.
those tracks and as I said please check out the video within a few days time for the full vinyl track list. Please do let me know if you've played Stray and what you thought of it. It's such a lovely little game. The world building in the game is amazing and the character of Stray, the little kitten who separates from his family so sadly at the beginning, goes on an amazing journey and meets B12. If you haven't played it I highly recommend it. I hope you like the tracks I upload within this video. Thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it. Please do like and subscribe and go and support me on Ko-fi if you'd like to donate a small amount to my videos. I'll see you guys all very soon and I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all again soon. Thanks guys! Thank you.